What's going on YouTube? This is Joe Sunstar Gaming here. Today I am bringing you 4.0, my original. I'm ju I just logged in, and here we go. And automatically I see that you know the login screen has changed. With th this looks really nice actually. Over here we can see how many class stories I completed. Sage is the only one I haven't done. Uh, oh, that's really cool. I actually like this. Looks very streamlined. And I like how much like you see more of the character very nice addition uh and i see right here we can create another little 60 character huh this is really cool i'm gonna create my little 60 character later but due to the straw poll that you guys posted it was very highly requested that I play my operative in this expansion. So let's go ahead and I'm just gonna log in and I will get to the story uh, in another episode right now. I'm just gonna start exploring 4.0 and seeing what it has to offer now that I am able to level again, which is very much exciting for me because I don't know, this is just I've waited so long for this expansion. I really hope they did not mess anything up like they did in uh, the last one. Just got what? What? What's this? Companions? Holy crap! They changed it. Oh my gosh! This is awesome, dude. Wow. All right. So now, ooh. I. Oh my! They changed the icons. That's so sick, dude. Wait. First strike. Oh, they did, and they, I remember that this is the, uh, that's a class story mission, I believe, for Ilum. I'm going to untrack a lot of this because I don't need it. I'm done with Oricon. I'm going to, I don't, like, it, start tracking every single one of my quests, even though all these were, like, not being tracked. Okay, what the heck's best foot forward? I think they changed that name. Or, no, I'd actually, no, they didn't, I think. I don't know. Here we go. And they're all gone. So, I believe, I don't know how you start it. I'm going to probably make a, ooh, what's this? Uh, overload shot and carbine burst reduce movement speed of targets stay damaged by 40% for 6 seconds. That's really nice. I'm, I'm going to go for flashbang and uh, infiltrator. Let's see, what else? Can, oh, I get three. Oh, yeah, I've always got, been able to get three. Um, I'm actually going to choose this because that looks interesting. Fortified Culto. I'm going to get these two. Uh, circumvation. Holo Tracers can be used. What? Holo Tracers. Wait, is that... Did they rename it? Countermeasures. I don't know. Um, I'm going to get... What is it? Uh, Jarring Strike? Do that one. Let's see. And now I'm going to fix this. Oh my gosh. This is beautiful. Wow. I like it. Um, they changed everything, basically. There we go. Nice. I like it. Wait. That's right. We do get... I think we get... Uh, like temporary hot bars or something really neat. Um... Wow, this is pretty nice. I like it. Social notifications. Okay, they, no, save, and now exit. What's this? I'm flying for PvP, okay. This seem, everything seems to have changed a bit. I don't know why. What's this? Oh yeah, they changed this so that you can have an advanced UI, which is kind of like what my UI used to look like. Um, let's go back to my UI. I think there is some sort of a, a I don't know, there's, I know there's a way that you can uh, export keybinds or something, preferences, keybind import export, um, main keybind things, well, guys I'm going to have official tutorials, what the heck, uh, later on in the, in my channel. For everything just like more professionally done tutorials than what I'm doing right now uh, so it appears that a lot of my stuff got changed uh, from 
going over to 4.0, including the fact that we now have a crew skills button and a companions and context button. Uh, I like that. Also, if we look in here, we now have mastery stat power, and all of these other ones have been changed uh, instead of now being what they were. I should. What the heck? How is my inventory so dang full? Gosh darn it. Uh, let's see. This is awkward. Uh, I'm gonna cut the video real quick and I will be back once I empty out my inventory because this is a lot of stuff. Okay, so guys, I just found out something that now there's actually something that shows how many pieces you have to a set, which is, in my opinion, re really actually kind of cool. Uh, because now we can see how much we have per like set, you know, whatever you want to call it. Uh, that, I think, is pretty good for this game. I have a lot of stuff in my inventory. I don't remember having this much stuff, I swear. This is weird. I like throw everything that's not needed. You don't worry about it later. Uh, I'm running out. Uh, this is what's wrong with being in the game for this long is that your mains collect so much crap that you have no place to put it. So you just kinda like, you run out of space. But another thing is that you should have this nice little animation when you hover over stuff. Okay. I'm gonna go sell some of this stuff. And then I will be good to go. I need Rackle vaccines. Do I need these? Do I need that? This other stuff I do need, however. And that's about it. Um, I'm gonna switch to my PVE gear really fast, so then I can go do stuff later on. Now, I am really excited to get this expansion underway. This is going to be really nice, guys. I'm excited. Let me know down in the comments if you guys are excited. I sure as heck am. Right, let's check Cartel Market. Start at 60. We can now purchase level 60 characters, guys. Grand Die Pack. Uh, gold armor pack. Uh, the gold armor pack offers only the absolute best armor sets the galaxy has to offer. That is kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. That is pretty cool. And then here we have our new packs. Oh, they, they replaced popular with... Uh, they replaced uh, newly added, I believe, with popular. That's weird. Equipment. I don't know. Oh, this makes sense now. This is kind of cool. I, like, I, I really honestly like this. Um, let's check and see what abilities we have. Heroic movement. Uh, season moment, restoring 2% of your maximum health every 2 3 seconds. Requires an active companion's last 84 seconds. That's pretty nice. Operative. The, and I believe the rest of our abilities, we... What? Random. Oh, I remember this. Random out. Psych. That is pretty dang cool. I like that. Uh, pretty dang nice. If you ask me, I like that feature being able to select just a random mount and equipping it. That's pretty cool. Um, go back to the interface ed editor. I want to see how we can get. I, I remember s them see saying something about you know temporary. Hot, oh, there it is, temporary ability bar. I messed up a bunch of stuff, so I'm gonna go back into the. Interface editor, and I mess up more stuff. I, oh, I'm sorry. Interface editor. Why is this so dang hard to move? Oh, there we go. Temporary ability bar. Um, I don't know quite how we use this. Interface editor. How do I use that? Enabled. Um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking I'm gonna have it somewhere where I can get to it easily, uh, but still be able to see it, so, let's move this out of the way, and how about I just put it, no, not there, because then it'll be covered up by obstacles from time to time, or just put it above chat, and then scale it down a little bit. Here we go. Look good. Uh, I don't know quite how we use that yet. I think it's like if you activate something, 
you can do that. I honestly don't know though. Baroque moment? Oh. That's true. Why did we have to relearn Baroque moment though? I actually didn't read the title before I just like read it off. Of course it's Baroque moment. So Darth Malgus, Hollow Statue. I'm gonna learn ya. Baroque moment. Wait. Oh, I see how this I think I understand how this works now. I think I do. Can I like I can't summon companions from here anymore. That's right. Um I'm gonna summon what's my best companion? I forget. I forget which companion I've geared. I think I've geared What the heck? Excuse me, how did this did they change how did what did they change? Did they change uh I think they changed it so you don't have to gear campaign. That's right. They made it so that you don't have to. That's right. Cool. I don't have to change my companion. Uh, my companion's gear anymore. That, that's nice. Mailbox. I want to check this real quick. Okay. Here's some goodies. Boom. Fallen Empire early access. Here's the coat. I'm not going to look at any of this stuff because that's a separate... <laughs> that is a separate video. Item recovery, item recovery. What? Why the hell? That's why. What? What? One of my characters got deleted? Wait. Wait. And affected by an issue on character load that resulted in the game needing to grant or return items to this character attached to the email. Huh. I don't know why. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. It's because these items, these were all on... Most of these items were on my companions. That makes a lot of sense now. And seeing as companions no longer need to wear legacy gear... Ah, you see, things make sense when you think of them long enough. That also explains why she has no pants on. And it's because her pants are in my inventory. <laughs> oh my gosh, that sounds so odd. Her pants are in my inventory. Oh my gosh. All right. Anyway, uh, I see that the recording is getting a bit long. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. This has been my first response to being in Fallen Empire. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I am going to be doing full walkthrough of Fallen Empire on this character. So stay tuned for that. I'm super psyched for this. And this is going to be a great expansion. I can tell already. Let's go, guys. And I'll be seeing you guys next time. Bye-bye.